I saw Microsoft's voting software, and um, it's better than my voting software idea, but is it? Um, their software allows you to look at your vote, and it, it like sort of encrypts it. Like so, you but you can you can actually check your vote. Um, my blockchain software, that's like variation on blockchain, um, is using a computer format that is all in a certain form, which is strings. And you could literally, if you want, go go inspect the binary and like look at it and like translate it for for strings. For letters um, in the English language, or we, well, it would be English. Well, it'd be. In, do we do it in Spanish too? I guess we would do it in Spanish also, but it would probably be in English. But then the answer could be in Spanish, or I don't know. I, I feel like no matter what, we would probably obfuscate the ledger a little bit, so it's not going to say the name. It's probably just say like a, a few letters. All right. So what I'm trying to say is. I think Microsoft's idea is better, but I think my idea is better if you're paranoid. Because in any programming language, I can check that code. And also, I mean, I can really inspect the document and be like, okay, uh, is there anything anything extra added on to this? I mean, people will um, really overanalyze the document with, the, and, and then the hash would be on TV or multiple hashes. but. Um, I don't. I don't really know. Um, so what I'm, what I'm trying to say is, um, I think I have contributed to society, and um, a lot of my ideas are bad, uh, a lot of them. Um, but that one specifically is so easy to code. I mean, if you if you understand basic coding, well, it, uh, um, intermediate coding, um, that it's like anybody could write that software. And then they, I, I think it's important that people can trust their elect, election system and or electoral system. And I think it's really disappointing that um, reality winner is still in jail. She, the, she's reality winner was from the NSA. She blew the whistle on voting machines getting hacked, and now um, no one knows if you can really. Um, trust the American voting machine system because everyone's kind of doing it individually. But what I, what I, in my opinion, the best people should do it and they should all come to cut, come together and make a decision on it. And maybe the best people are from Microsoft because they're so good at um, operating systems and they did make the, make their voting system open source. But honestly, I, I it, 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 it's a, it's a very real question whether or not you want to have um, hidden votes or votes you can look at, but that are hard to look at. Because in my in my idea, like maybe we take a picture of you when you go to vote, and then we take a hash of that picture, and that hash is your ID, like in, in my idea. But um, is that really that good of an idea? <laughs> like, I don't know, I never know, I never know. Um, but um, I really don't think that part is, is even relevant, um, but it's still, the point is, it's still hidden. Like, you can't find out whose picture it is from the hash, but um, you can figure out if every single person voted in the town for this person, except for this one person. Or, but, you, and you could also probably figure out based on time of day with my idea, because the, the votes are kind of attaching to the vote in front of it, and then the vote behind you is attaching to you. Um, so you wouldn't really have an anonymity. And I feel like if people are vetting the code enough, because this this code that for for this Microsoft voting machine that they're going to use, um, it, it's it's on the internet. You can read it. Then probably it's trustworthy. I mean, I, I know it's trustworthy, but I don't I, I don't even know enough to read the code to figure out if it's trustworthy because I'm not a cryptography expert. And um, yeah, that's the thing about um, cryptocurrency that's super confusing. It's really hard to explain how. Um, how um, markets move, and then you don't even realize how they move until you're like, oh, okay, that's how they move. But, um, yeah, it's crazy. Crazy how much money you can make off of an old cryptocurrency if you've been kind of stocking up on it for a while. 
looking forward to the having. Anyways, so, um, yeah. I, I'm for making sure voting machines work. 